Hey guys, be sure to follow my new Instagram, marspeed underscore official. It's a good place to send me questions, and it's easy to answer them all in one place. Hey guys, so being a Mopar enthusiast, I usually try to post car news and updates about the new Mopars, like the Durango SRT and the Dodge Demon. Well, I was on vacation when they announced the 2018 Dodge Challenger Hellcat Widebody on June 27th, so this may be a bit late, but I'm still making a video anyways, because I think it's really cool. The Hellcats are crazy enough as it is, and now we get the wide-body version on the Challengers. It's still got the 707 horsepower, but now there are some key differences. First off, we have 11-inch wide fender flares, the same ones that are on the Demon, making the wide-body 3.5 inches wider than the normal Hellcat. This means Dodge can offer 305mm Pirelli P0s for all four tires, which is an increase of almost an inch wide compared to the old 275 P0s that were only optional on that old Hellcat. The wide body also gets a bit faster, with a 0.1 second boost in the 0-60, bringing the time down to 3.4 seconds, and a 0.3 second boost in the quarter mile, bringing the time down to 10.9 seconds. The lateral grip has also improved 0.04 Gs up to 0.97. The only thing, however, is the top speed does drop down from 199 miles per hour to 195. Unlike the Demon, you can get a 6-speed manual or 8-speed automatic, and there's also a new engine cooling system, meaning this car is really track-ready. Dodge claims you can drive the Hellcat hard for 20 minutes at 100 degrees Fahrenheit without any power loss whatsoever. On for to the braking, there are 6 piston Brembos along with 2-piece rotors that are bigger than some rims out there, being 15.4 inches. This is also the first Challenger Hellcat with electronic power steering and street, sport, and track modes. Now on to colors, the 2018 Dodge Challenger SRT Hellcat widebody, and also the Demon as well, will be available in 14 different colors as shown on the screen. Um, some of them include the F8 Green, Granite Crystal, Indigo Blue, and Plum Crazy. The Hellcat widebody starts at a base price of $72,590, which is about $7,300 more than the original Hellcat, just for wide wheels, tires, and bodywork. Ordering starts in July of 2017. And here's a chart that shows all the differences between the normal and the wide-body Hellcats. So let me know what you think of the wide-body Hellcat. Looks to me like Dodge tried to add something new to their Hellcats, and I'm definitely a fan of it, but the price seems a bit steep. Alright guys, so thanks for watching, like, subscribe, and I'll see you next video.